When cutting your cuticle goes wrong, really wrong. I wanted the big pack of nails that were clear like this, but the dollar store didn't sell it and I wasn't going to run nowhere else because I didn't feel like it and this was just a dollar. So it's 24 nails from Kiss for a dollar. Next step is to lay out your nails. I lay them from thumb to pinky and thumb to pinky. This is left, this is right. Now I'm gonna glue them on and I'm gonna paint them with this Etsy ballet slippers. Well, it won't focus. I'm gonna do a coat of white first so the color picks up a little bit better since it's so light. Then I'll show you the final result. And I'm using Nail Her glue because it's the best glue and it stays on forever. So hopefully it hopefully it stays on a while. Last time it was like two days and it didn't want to come off. And my nails are funky because I have acetone polish I've been using because I need to get rid of it and then like it makes your nails look crappier this is a finished product this nail is kind of bandy because I kept my cuticles and it wouldn't stop bleeding so it's going to be interesting to paint it these nails are way too long for me so I'm going to cut them down next and then I'll show you the real final product after step is to foul it and I'm going to be using this foul from Sally's. I did them a little shorter than what I wanted to actually do them. Get that stuff at the bottom like we you know when you foul it. I did them a little bit shorter than I wanted to. I wanted to do them a little bit longer but maybe this way I'll actually leave them on for a while because I usually take them off pretty fast. The next step is I'm going to use this French chip or like just to paint the whole nails. Um, so when I put, this one's a ballet slippers Essie. It gives it just a little bit more of color when you put white underneath it. Coat of the white. As you can see, my stupid finger is still bleeding and it burns. I think I got polish on the cuticle. This is one coat of the white. And it was not that easy to paint because, I'm going to show you. See, that's some of my blood. I'm sure you want to see that. I need to throw it away. It's a little bitty tip coat. It's actually to do tips. I never really use it. So it's a little bitty brush. So it's hard to get it the coats even. So I'll show you the next step when I put one coat of polish. And then I have to clean these things up. I haven't painted that messy in a while, Jesus Christ. We'll have to find a way to clean it. Some some nails are darker white than others, you can see. Some of them I got more coats than others. I don't want to do a second coat though, because I don't want it to be too thick white. So we'll just see what happens. Do not use this polish. I took everything off because this polish does not dry. I do not know how old it is, but this polish shut from day one, I believe. That's why I never really use it and stayed in the um thing so now we're starting over from scratch and i got stupid stuff all over my hands i'm gonna have to wash them then dry and then redo it i'm aggravated